Okay, we're gonna show you the easy way. When I put the tape on, I wanna get it above the knot. I don't wanna put it here because then the part that's gonna be the stripe, that will get, uh, it, it can't stripe because it'll get covered up. There's my shuttle. Here's my two colors and I separate those. And then the first thing I have to do before I do any switching is to get that the shuttle to go through. Otherwise, when I switch, they uh, they won't show. The black is on the bottom, so I'm going to spread that out. Not only is the black on the bottom, but it's the one that has five. And I fan them out in order. None of them are doing crisscross. They're all in order. This one has four, so I'm going to put them in between those. Since the black is on the bottom, it needs to come up, so I'm going to lift up the black. My stripe doesn't show very much. It's really messy, so I'm going to push it and pull it, push and pull, and there my stripe shows. The green's on the bottom. I'm going to fan it out in order, no crisscross. And the black will always go on the outside because it has the most. And there's no crisscross on that either. Go in order. The black's on the bottom, the green's on the top, so I pick up the black. Oops. And I push. And I pull. There's my stripe. And, and I'm passing the shuttle through. If I don't pass the shuttle through, the stripe won't show. And they, I do want to get them in order. Okay, the green's on the bottom. I'm going to fan them out. In order, no crisscross. Then black goes on the way outside. And the black's on the top, so I'm going to pick up the green. And I push, and I pull, and there's my beautiful black stripe. There shouldn't be a big loop there, and I should pass it through the same direction it came from. It should go zigzag, zigzag. The black's on the bottom, so I'm going to fan it out. And I'm going to put green in between, just like that. And the green's on the top, so I pick up the black. When I pick them up, I want to pick them up close to the top, because that's where they're straight. Push, pull, pass. Now this way is easy. It's not particularly fast. Once you kind of get how that works, if you're feeling like you'd like to be able to do it faster, you can do it the way that I showed you at first, where you go like this. And you can see that does go quite a bit faster. One way is not better than the other, it's just that one's a little faster. But the one you can do is what's going to be faster than the one that you can't do. If you find that you can't do it, then it's not going to be a good method for you. So, the keys to success are to pull and push. No, no matter which method you do, if you don't pull and push, your stripe isn't going to show. You have to pass it through. If you don't pass it through, your stripe isn't going to show. When you're done, you still want to comb it out and straighten it up, and uh, it's all good.